Hey there guys. Uh, what I wanted to show you today was I didn't uh, when I made this little temperature controlled circuit uh, temperature controlled circuit yeah I suppose it is actually because it's a circuit which will work and start the fans that fan there and this fan here depending on temperature so as it gets warmer on my panel and then you can see my panel through there yep it will warm up just on the other side of there is an NTC if I can get that out without disturbing everything too much let's just pull that up can you see that you can see that good that's the NTC that's a 5 5k at 25 C negative temperature coefficient resistor and this little circuit which I've already done a, a video on but I here is where it comes in and this is where before I had a 4.7k uh, resistor just across here but now it goes out and it goes up there to that NTC and as it warms up uh, it, 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 it puts the fans on it does have a variation of speed on the fan but there's not a great deal in it um, you know, you've sort of got slow but it's not as low they'll be going around it like you know that sort of fashion be more like this sort of fashion and faster and faster and, yeah but it's not on full blast if the temperature is not that high so the variation on the resistance um, you know that, that does mean that it works okay ignore these little batteries these are just charged yeah, that one's there charged ready to go on this one when this battery sort of fails you know because that keeps that little clock going it'd be nice now if it would warm up enough for it to kick in i decided to start doing this because it's on a, a day where um, i was hoping there'd be some clouds and it'd go on it'd go off it would go on and go off and that's exactly what i wanted it to do rather than before when i was just connected up the fans in series two 12 volt fans in series to the maximum of 22 volts open on this solar panel um, but it gives me around about sort of 17 volts with a with a load on it so really uh, the two in series they never go full pelt yeah uh, these fans because if you they're just connected up in series I know the wires are a bit of a mismatch but I know what they all do where they all go and it's, it's fine and it would just be nice if it kicked in now but what I may have to do is just um, add to this video because it's not obviously you can see they're not running at the minute um, they were a few minutes ago that's why I decided to pull the camera out and, and do this um, but hopefully within the next um, maybe a few minutes it might just kick in but it works really well I've had this working now when did I put that video out? well about a day later or the next day the NTCs came I'm sure I said that in the video as well did you see it? it's just try to start kicking off and I can I can feel a bit more warmth coming through now there we go there we go look at that little poetry in motion and it's not full blast the other one hasn't actually got enough energy for the other one to be spinning just yet so we've already got one on but I don't know if you notice it just slightly moved then oh and again and again and again here we go a little bit warmth go on I mean now it's cooling and so that one's gone that one, that one stopped as well well, you can't really see the other one, can you? So, there you go. See, and the way this works is when those two fans are kicking in because it's nice and warm on that panel, on that NTC, um, the air blows through through here and it comes out between the batteries. So it blows air up here, it blows air you know, up, up the top between the blinds and the fan, keeping that cool comes out of the batteries it also blows a bit of air in this area so it goes between these cooling fins uh, on the bottom of the um, of this solar charger this is brilliant it's a bit dusty let's get in there give everything a clean but this is absolutely brilliant um, you know it, it does it, it, it sucks every little bit of uh, it's an MPPT, maximum power point tracking. And 
even first thing in the morning, even when there's no sun out there and it's just light, even on those like horrible like wintry days, I think I only had two days where it wasn't really capable of doing anything. There we go, look, it's warming up a bit. So one fan's kicked in. And the other one's just getting a little bit of a, not enough to get it going. But as that sun comes up, yep, it's a little bit of And like I say, as that, as that gets warmer, as it gets warmer, they'll just get quicker. Um, and it's great. And it also means that when there's not so much warmth there and the sun's not coming down on the panel, those fans stop and the power that it would take to run those fans then goes to my batteries, which is what we want, yeah? I don't know if well, it says 23 in here, but I don't know if you can see that there. Yeah, it's flashing because my batteries are charged already. Even though I left the lights on, you know, I have the lights on, as soon as it starts getting a little bit, uh, not dark, just, I just want the lights on, I, I put them on. And sometimes I just put them on during the day, just so it's like pulling some energy from the battery because I keep thinking, I'm gutted because th this energy is going to waste now. Um, but I am going to set up some more fans in here and I'm going to set up some more little circuits like this just for myself in here and I'll put the NTCs up in the window so it starts kicking on the fans and from here. I don't know if you can hear that but they're on a bit louder now, a bit faster. Uh, it just goes to show that it works great. It works great and this has been like this running now for a, a couple of weeks or um, since I uh, did the video literally the next day or the day after the, the, the NTCs came. I actually got three different types of NTCs. Um, I got one which was more expensive that I've not even used. Um, it was a lot more expensive. These are 25 seconds for temperature coefficient or something and the other one's 7 seconds. I don't know what that means, I need to look that up. I think the faster acting, I'm not sure, I don't know, I need to look that up. But in order for me to get the free delivery, I had to spend over a fiver, so I spent five quid um, on these parts, NTCs, I've got three different types, one was just a singular of one, and the other was a, a couple of few of one, and one was five of these particular ones that I'm using here. I will put in, I don't know if I can put comments um, on these videos that I'm doing at the minute, because I'm using a different system. And, or I may do it through my Windows machine just because I'm about to do another video on the Windows machine just to sort of debunk some things that are being said about what happens if you don't activate Windows 10 or yeah because they went to the extremes of saying after an hour of you not having uh, if you're using a Windows 10 machine that's not activated after an hour it'll mess up your softwares you won't be able to get updates everything turns to hell and they were pretty insistent, but that's not the case. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you how that's not the case at all. Um, right. So, just so you can see that that actually does work. It works very efficiently, um, and I'm very, very pleased with the way this is set up. And I will be converting this to a proper board because uh, it's worth it. And I want this back because I want to do some more, more prototyping. Cheers, for watching, guys.